Good morning guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jason, this is Old Car Guy. Today we're gonna to be working on getting that back in that. So stay tuned. So today is Friday, March the 27th, and yesterday we spent rebuilding the top end of this Chrysler 340. And as you can see, it's a little bit dirty, it's a little bit dusty, but we're also gonna be freshening it up with a fresh coat of paint and getting this dropped in to my dad's 1936 Dodge D4. A couple of things that we have to do to make modifications for is we've got a heater hose that comes out right here and the other one goes in right here. The problem is that hole is not the same as that. We're gonna to have to drill that hole out and tap it for a bigger fitting so that dad can finally get his heater core hooked up in the car and have some heat on those cold summer mornings or spring mornings or fall morning, whatever he's gonna be wanting to drive this thing uh, and have a little bit of comfort while he's driving it. So we did have this sent out to St. John Engine Rebuilders, the same place that I had mine sent out to. And uh, I didn't film any of the assembly of this yesterday just because, well, you're gonna be getting the assembly on mine uh, in the next video. So we, we're at the point now where this thing is ready to basically get dropped in the car and that's what we're going to be kind of focusing on today. Today's video will be fairly short so we're just going to time lapse a little bit of us dropping that in the car uh, but first before we do anything we've got to get the car from storage over there into the bay for the hoist because we will need to be able to get that up in the air and uh, get those torque converter bolts and the exhaust and all that stuff hooked back up. So without further ado, let's get this thing moved over and let's get started on dropping this 340 back in the Dodge. So we've got the 340 here getting ready to go into the 36 Dodge. So we're gonna uh, just, you know, wave our magic wand and it'll drop right in by itself. Okay, so we're getting ready to start this thing for the first time. We've got the coolant in the radiator. We've got the carburetor all primed up, so let's, well, we hope anyway. Let's try it. Something that we did a little bit different this time is that we did manage to get the heater hooked up. So it took a heck of a lot more antifreeze than we thought initially, but so far it sounds good. We're gonna have to get out for a drive and see if that vibration is finally gone. Fingers crossed.
She's out for her maiden little cruise. And so far so good, everything sounds good. We'll wait and see when he comes back this way. Just how good it really sounds. Miles for miles. Sounds good, runs good. I like it. So we're getting ever so close to getting two projects completed. We've got Grampy's car, the 36 Dodge with the new refreshed Chrysler 340 in it. And it sounds really, really good. So at this point, we're gonna call this a video. And uh, remember guys, Car Guy and Six Fan Show is on Thursday evenings, seven o'clock central, eight Eastern. And it alternates every week between my channel and Straight Six Fan. His link is right here. And you guys go over there and check out his channel because He's got some pretty good stuff going on over there as well. So stay focused on the windshield, not the rear view mirror. I love you guys. God bless. Let's do it again in the near future.